Hi, I'm Claire and I'm part of the sales team here at Don Amot Leisure Kingdom based in Hilton, Derbyshire. And today I want to show you around our latest van up from Valet. It's a 2016 Swift Rio 340. It's on the Fiat Ducato as a base vehicle. It's a 2.3 130 brake horsepower on a manual gearbox. So as we go around the Rio, it's a nice, short, sweet, compact van. Styled with the Fiat alloy wheels. As we go down the van, I'm going to point out what features it's got. So as you look here, that is a fresh water drain. Here is where we put the water in. And this here is if we wanted to take the water from a vessel, an aqueroll, whatever, you can put a pump into there and you can pump the water in as well. This is where the cassette toilet is stored. And here is where we plug the electrics in. This here is the flue for the heating when you're using it on gas and as we go around to the back of the vehicle you can see it's got the dual reversing camera it's got the tow ball fitted and the rear door opens fantastically so you can sit Lint. under the, the, there use it as a canopy have a glass of wine watch the world <laughs> go by or go to B&Q and put six foot planks of wood in it <laughs> The choices are endless. You'll notice here, there's a little sign for an electric step on the rear, but because it's got the tow bar, the previous owner had the step removed. So, I'm gonna close this roof down, and we'll go and have a look around the other side. So, as we come around this side, if we look up, we can see we've got the canopy, we've got the awning light, fridge vents, the gas store, two 6kg bottles and the waste drain is there. Fuel cap and the habitation door. So let's go inside and have a look. So welcome inside of the 340. So as we take a look to the front we can see it's a six speed manual gearbox. The screen there for the reversing camera. It's got the stereo and obviously you can connect your phone to that so you can drive safely, um, speed restrictor and all the usual that you'd expect, place for your mugs and your mints. <coughs> Both seats pivot around so they turn the front into a lounging area. You can relax the seats back so you can find your own comfort range and you've got your armrest there as well. As we turn around here you can see that we've got two passenger seats, the TV bracket above and storage. The kitchen's well equipped, we've got three gas rings and an electric ring, we've got a separate oven and grill and beneath here is a little drawer. A utensil drawer as well and we've got a fridge with a, with a freezer compartment and this fridge will work on gas and mains. It has a microwave fitted, great storage throughout. It has a solar panel on the roof and a TV aerial. As we turn around here, you can see that we've got a little wet room. It's compact, but it does everything it needs to. So inside there, you've got a sink, hot and cold water. The shower head pulls out of the sink and then clips up there should you need to use the shower and the toilet is just there as well. Okay. We have wardrobe space. Although it's not the biggest, it does the job. Another TV bracket. <coughs> this area here is a perfect lounge area and it also makes into your bed as well. Now this travels for and also sleeps for because above my head we have a fixed bed. Now the fixed bed, if it's just two of you, comes all the way down, or if somebody was staying over, they would sleep beneath. So let's give it a whirl. We'll get the electric bed down to show you how it we works. We need to turn this on, don't we? There we go. So, simple press of a button, and your bed will come down. And back up again. So it's nice and simple. So, 
If you want to come and take a closer look at the Swift Rio, why not pop over to Don A. Mott Leisure Kingdom, come and see one of the sales team um, and they'll answer any further questions and show you around the little Swift Rio 340.